Hey, what's up guys? Out of the Box Bros here, back at it again with another video. With Costco's famous Telepat rotisserie chicken. Costco's rotisserie chicken is made fresh every day. She's readily available anytime, unlike some supermarkets which serve their chicks after lunch. You can pick up one of these bad girls for only $5. Costco holds their chickens to high standards. No preservatives, MSG free, gluten free, clothing free, and USDA grade A busty badass chicks. Taking a look at the packaging, I mean it's pretty nice. It comes in a sturdy plastic container with a clear lid. It also does a good job holding in all that extra juice. Mmm, so moist. It's like a greased up Brazilian babe on the beach. But how does it compare to Ralph's Colossal Chicken? Let's find out. The packaging by far takes the lead. I mean, you know, did you see all that seasoning? It was love at first sight. I like my chicken like my morning workouts. Extra moist. She was a little pricey at $8.50, so let's see if it compares to our go-to Costco chick. She may look good on the outside, but so it's on the inside that counts. Ralph's Colossal Chicken, although curvy, falls short weighing only 2.4 pounds compared to Costco's 3 pounds. And for a buck fifty more, you can get yourself two Costco chickens. That's a total of six pounds. But is it worth the extra coin? Let's find out. Hi, I'm hungry. I'm ready for some chicken. This feels like a good piece. Mmm, very soft. Oh, this one tastes pretty good. I don't usually like skin, but this one tastes pretty good. I can taste the skin. Corona test. Even better. Mm, a lot of good flavor. A little bit cold. Still really good. I really like this one. It's moist. It's soft. Oh, this one's like moist. It's got good flavor. Moist. This would be great with some sauce. I don't think, I don't, I don't see how the second one can be any better than this one. Ooh, can I have some more of that? This one's dry. This one tastes worse than the chicken breast I make. I have a way better taste than this one. Mmm. Mmm. Definitely not as much flavor. Right, I don't eat any more of this one. It's pretty dry. Oh. I would definitely have to add some seasoning with this one. It's not as soft, and it just doesn't have as much flavor. Not that flavorful. Let's see how it tastes with Corona. It's still dry. Fortunately, man, that Ralph's chicken was so crappy, I gotta wash it down with my Corona again. Hey, man, where'd you get that? I want some. Oh, oh. thanks, man. <laughs> It looks like that wasn't very much of a comparison at all. Won't you think, Patrick? I'm pretty ashamed of Ralph's. But our Costco came out victorious, as always, in price, quantity, and taste. You get the Costco experience. You get the return policy. <laughs> I can't return my Ralph's ticket anymore, man. I'm sorry, man. That was like nine bucks. <laughs> So anyways, <laughs> thanks a lot for watching. Please go out and check out our first video, the Costco pizza review. Mm. And uh, we'll catch you on the next one. And please remember to like and subscribe. And we'll be back at it again with another one. <laughs> thanks, guys. And if you live in Southern California, this is going to cost you about $10.75, which is actually a very good deal. Costco does offer a phone number where you can